Hi everyone. So, ang topic natin ngayon is about concatenation. So, ito yung kapag gusto mong mag-combine ng text or string na galing sa iba-ibang cell. So, let's say, for example, you have here part 1, part 2, and part 3, and gusto natin silang i-combine. So, there are actually three ways to do that. So, concat, concatenate, or by using an ampersand symbol. So, sa concat, ang um, definition niya is concatenates a list or range of text strings. Okay? So, kapag nag-open parenthesis ka, you have text 1 as your argument, tapos meron kang makikitang dot, dot, dot. Ang ibig sabihin ng tatlong dots is you can add as much as text that you would like sa function na to. Okay? So, meron naman siyang number of characters na limit, and I don't think na aabot ka naman sa... Um, 254 characters in creating uh, a formula, okay? So, so our text one is, let's say, ito yung part one ng string natin. And you can press comma. Tapos kukunin mo yung second part. Next argument is text number three. And you can close that and press enter. And this is going to be the output, which is pinagdikit-dikit lang siya na version ng text na to. So, you can double-click this handler para makita mo pa yung output ng ibang cells. And similar lang yan sa concatenate. So, concatenate naman, you can press down arrow key and press tab para hindi mo na kailangan i-type ng buo yung word na concatenate. And then, you can do the same thing. You can get this one. Next is this. And then, the part 3 naman. Okay? So, you will get basically the same output. Alright? So, yung iba naman, what they do is concatenate tab. So, depende naman sa arrangement. So, pwede mo naman siyang i-rearrange. Okay? So, magkakaroon naman siya ng reverse version. Kakaroon naman siya ng reverse version ng concatenation. Okay? And then, the ampersand is actually this one. Okay? So, tinatawag siyang ampersand sa programming term. Pero, yan din yung end sign. Okay? This one. Alright. So, what you can do is equal sign and then get this part and then use an ampersand, get the next part, use an ampersand, and get part 3. So, basically, pinagdikit-dikit mo lang yung tatlo. This ampersand symbol is used to combine text, string, or values. Okay? So, if you double-click that, you will still get the same result as this one. Alright? So, what if naman you would like to add a text string na hindi kasama sa given mo? Kasi ito yung mga given mo na values. Okay? So, we can do that. So, what you have to do is, let's say, ampersand, and then you add a rabbit ear, press space, and then dash, and then another space, and then rabbit ear. So, important yung rabbit ear. So, it's important to... Add rabbit ears, okay? Kasi kung ano man yung nasa loob ng rabbit ears, yun ang ilalabas ng Excel, alright? So, you can add another ampersand, and let's say we would like to add another word, which is done, okay? And then, kailangan may rabbit ears din yan, kasi you are declaring text or alphanumeric characters. So, press enter lang, and you will have the following result. Okay? So, hindi ibig sabihin na given lang na values ang pwede mong magamit or cell references lang ang pwede mong magamit in concatenating cells. Okay? Um, pwede rin na you will be declaring yung mga fixed na values like this one. Okay? So, concatenate, pwede rin yan. Let's say, gusto mong mag-add ng asterisk. Kapaloob mo lang siya sa rabbit ears. You can press enter. Okay, so meron ka ng asterisk. So, let's say this one. Gusto mo mag-add ng dash. Maglalagay ka lang dyan. Pupuesto mo lang siya. And you will have this result. Okay? Alright. So, I would suggest you practice your assignment. So, this is the sample output. And this is your given. And this one, kailangan merong lumabas na extra characters, which is the active space dash and space okay so this is the sample output and i would suggest if you're gonna create your formula dito at saka dito 
please do not drag muna. Huwag niyo muna siyang ida-drag. Okay, practice niyo muna na ita-type mo yung formula like 5 to 10 times para ma ma-familiarize mo muna. And then kapag naka-5 or 10 ka na and you feel confident na sa pagko-compose ng formula, you can um drag the formulas, okay? So this part you will use the function concat. This part you will use concatenate. And this part you will use ampersand. All right? So that's it. Thank you and good luck. Bye.